chalkboard paint, which would be good for Jensen's room and it would also be good for our kitchen, which is what the plan is. Hey everyone, currently in B&Q because I'm trying to find stuff for the home because redoing it. Um, I say redoing it, we're always doing it. Chalkboard paint, which would be good for Jensen's room and it would also be good for our kitchen, which is what the plan is. I'm looking at brooms. I need a good sturdy broom. Really loving that. Redoing the old bathroom floor. I like the idea of doing an earthy bathroom, quite nice. So home now, this is where I'm putting the chalkboard. So I need to take that down and uh, get painting. Gone for this rust oleum chalkboard paint. Writable, erasable finish with a soft brush, which was £4.50 I think for this. And 18 for that. So first of all I am unscrewing the sign that I've had up for years. Underneath is sort of like smoke mark from where I <laughs> set fire to a pan on the cooker which went all the way up the wall. And um, yeah so I'm just removing that and then going to give it a good old spray with some of my Fabulosa which I'm loving at the moment. It is Garden Party. I found it in Home Bargains. It's really really beautiful smell. So instead of using the correct tape that I'm supposed to use, I was going to buy some but I thought no, I know I've got some. I'm using sellotape because Jensen had my, my, my tape so I can't, I can't use that. So sellotape I'm hoping is going to do the job. I'm starting with a little test patch. This is quite a serious colour and um, it's really scary actually because it's not like you can just easily go over black and it's quite a big area of the kitchen that I'm doing so fingers crossed this goes well. This was actually going on really really nicely even though it was like leaving line you could see it needed another coat it definitely doesn't come across like it needs more than two coats so i'm really chuffed with that because i hate painting and i'm not the best at it Round one. Well impressed with that so far. Cannot wait to get the second coat on. It's definitely going to need another coat. That goes on brilliantly. Look at that. Let it dry. Nick said on the paint tub that it says 60 minutes drying. Oh, it says quick drying time on the front, but he says it takes 60 minutes. Don't believe that because practically dry apart from those couple of lines and it's going to be about 10 minutes so I can't read it it's, the writing's too small so I'm going to get cracking on the second coat loving this this is going on brilliantly for a second coat and being more careful with the second coat than I was the first uh, because obviously I want this to look as best it can, but this is going on beautifully now.
as you can see just how really nice this is going on you can see that it doesn't need more than one two coats so super happy i think all in all it probably took me about an hour and a half to do two coats tape it all up and chalk on it so it really didn't take long at all it didn't take long to dry probably about 10 minutes in between so uh, this, this stuff's brilliant tape is off now I need to put the menus on it I'm more nervous about doing this bit than I was painting it and that's that's saying something because it's black paint but I'll put all of this onto there And that's that really really glad i did that feels really nice chalks on nicely <sighs> let me know what you think in the comments down below and if you've done this if you have what do you think of it does it last um yeah loving it i will see you all again in my next video bye